Hello everyone, I'm Abby. And I'm Keith. Welcome to our 80s life. Now back in the 80s, we were super into stickers. We've already shared some of our sticker books in previous videos. And you know what else we did in a previous video? We had a little contest. We had a scratch and sniff sticker challenge. Because you guys know, if you're from the 80s, like... We were all about the scratch and sniff stickers. Here's one thing I've noticed about scratch and sniff stickers from the 80s. Mm -hmm. They really don't quite smell like what they used to smell back then. Some of them do. Some of them have retained their scent pretty well. A lot of them haven't though. Well, maybe some of them were muddled by the other things that were on the page with the sticker. Yeah, it's like if you had pizza next to strawberry. Oh, pizza was a strong one. Yeah, it was a strong one. Yeah. Well, speaking of strong, when I was picking my selections <laughs> for this competition, Abby walked into the room and like goes, what did you do in I here? I almost gagged. It smells so stinky in this room right now. Like he stirred up. I stirred some... up 40 years of awesomeness. 40 years of stink. Okay, so we haven't told them what we're going to do. We are going to have part two of the Scratch and Sniff Challenge. A lot of you guys said you wanted to see us do this again. Yeah, and if you remember last time, I lost. I won! I think she dubbed herself the Queen of Scratch and Sniff Stickers. I did. I am the Queen of Scratch and Sniff. I'm not worthy. <laughs> so I'm looking for a little redemption tonight. Last time, I did have to file a complaint. What? She picked really hard ones. I didn't. Grape? Grape is not hard. And I picked, well, <clears throat> I think that was the only one I got. But I picked really <laughs> easy ones for her. I gave her lots of softballs. She gave me fastballs or maybe even curveballs. Not even true. Um, but really? <laughs> I didn't think gingerbread was that hard. Gingerbread? Come on. I thought it was does easy. Does, does, does gingerbread even have a smell? Yes. I think I just have a stronger sniffer than you. I think you do. Okay, so we're going to do this again. Just like before, the rules are the same. We have each picked five scents, and we've pulled them carefully out of our sticker books and put them on some cards. We haven't seen each other's selections. Nope. They could be the same. They may not be. All right. Well, one All thing right. is this for certain. I'm really bad at this game, so we'll see if that continues. We'll see. I did. I may have thrown you a couple of curveballs. Oh, great. Maybe at least one that's harder. All right. More challenging. Game over. I'm out. Nope. We got to try. Do you want to go? I went first last time. Do you want to go first, or yeah, do you want me? Yeah, I'll go first. I'll get it over with. <clears throat> All right. Cover those eyes. All right. The first scent. You didn't notice I covered up my nose. Oh, no. You can't. You can't cover up your nose if you're going to smell. Okay. All right. I'm scratching it real good. Scratch it real good. And it smells. I, I don't want to file a complaint again. You can definitely smell it. Okay, here we go. Scent number one. All right, one more time. I'm going to go with strawberry. No, it's not strawberry. Is that close? Well, not really. Um, <laughs> okay, last time we played this game, you kept guessing bubblegum. Oh, and you gave me bubblegum. <laughs> so I gave you bubblegum, and Ooh. then you didn't get it. Here's number two. All right, scratching. Okay, this one definitely smells like what it says. Okay. All right, here we go. I don't smell anything. You don't smell it? No. Okay, hang on, let me scratch it more. It's like a big whiff. Oh. You don't know? You don't have any guesses? I'm going with strawberry again. Could you not smell it at all? No, I'm going with strawberry. I think your nose is broken. Do you have COVID? I don't know. <laughs> Try again. It's not strawberry. Licorice? No, but that is a good guess. It's similar to licorice. Okay. Uh, it was root beer. Okay. Okay? Okay. Now, does, do you smell the root beer now? Yeah, no. I smell it. Okay. All right, so I wasn't really trying to pull a fast one or anything. Okay, here's the next one. 
Okay, here we go. All right. Make a big whip. Smells good. Mm hmm. I have no clue what it is. No clue? No. Give me one more uh, scratch. Do you want a hint? No. Um, laundry detergent. No, it's a fruit. Not strawberry. Not strawberry. Orange. No. Cherry. No. Banana. It's, it's peach. Oh gosh. Peach. Smell <laughs> yeah. again. Smell it again. Peach. Oh. I'm terrible at this game. Yeah, this one's cute. It has a Pac-Man on it. All right, I'm 0 for 3. <clears throat> it's okay, babe. I think Abby's going to get an easy win here. Are they getting harder as we go? Well, this next one is the hardest one. Oh, boy. But you might not think it's hard. Okay. This one's not as pleasant. Oh, wait. I have to show them. Okay. Take a whiff. It smells like tires. Like oil. Mm. No, we did oil last time, so it's not oil. Mm, it kind of smells good. Yeah? Is it skunk? No. Oh. That one was leather. Uh, like cowboy boots. Yeah, I don't know about that. Smell again. All right. It kind of smells like leather. This game is much harder than it looks, trust me. It, yeah, it is. Okay. This is your last one. Of course, Abby will probably make it look easy. She'll probably go five for five. No, I won't. All right, here is the final one for you to guess. Okay. Okay. That's stinky. What do you know that's stinky? Skunk. It is a skunk! Yes! Yes! yes. Alright, my turn. Okay. Alright. Lay it on me. Number one. I'm ready. Show them. I will. I was getting them in the order I wanted to do them. Yep. I did the skunk last because it was so strong. Okay, here is number one. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Mm. Peppermint. What's your answer? Mm -hmm. But it's like weird because it smells like peppermint and garlic. It's like what could that be? Uh, I'm going to say peppermint. That would be root beer. Oh, you had root beer also. Yeah. Yeah. But yours doesn't smell very good. It's it like something. <laughs> I feel like I got too close to the pizza one. I'll give you a paper cut. <laughs> On my lip. On your lip. That's going to hurt. Yeah. All right, you ready okay. for number two? Okay. Number two. Okay, show them. I am. Let's scratch it real good. You're going to scratch it first. Real good. There's number two. Okay. All right, here you go. Garlicky. All of yours smell garlicky. The pizza got too close. Okay, wait, is it pickle? No. Oh, that man. That was strawberry shake. No, it wasn't. It smelled like garlic pickle. It smells like strawberry. You lie. <laughs> see, now you see no, how hard no, this game is. No, yours are bogus because they all were mixed in with the pizza one. No, no. Mm -mm. All right, number three. Okay. I don't smell no, anything. I, oh. <laughs> I was like, I don't smell anything. All right, here we go. Is it time now? It's time. Oh. Mmm. Baby powder. Roses. Oh, that was close. That yeah, was close. Okay. Darn. All right, 0 for 3. We might, uh, we might pull out a win here. Oh, I'm getting nervous. Shoot. These are harder than last All time. Right. Okay. I'm going to show it to everyone at home. Okay. And I'm bringing it up to your nose. Okay. Pickle! Ding, 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 ding! I like that one. That did. That was a strong pickle. 
Okay. Better than the other non pickle one. Okay. All right, so I got one, and if you're keeping score at home, we each have one. Because he got skunk. All right. Is this my last one? This is your last one. Ooh, so this is for all the marbles. Yes, it is. Else we tie. All right, here we go. We might have to have a tiebreaker. Okay. Oh, boy. All right, it's coming up to your nose. Okay. Hmm. That's so interesting. It kind of smells like a pine forest, but I guess that last time, so I don't think it's pine forest. Uh, fresh mowed grass. Yes! Is oh, that it? It was grass! What? At the end! Oh! oh. Oh, leave me hanging. He left me hanging. He's totally bitter. I am bitter. You're so jealous of me being the queen of the Scratch and Sniff stickers. Oh, good job. Oh, I only got two. Yeah. Okay, those were hard. I right, got close your eyes. I got your bonus here. Oh, get a bonus one. Okay, so, I'll just close, just close your okay. eyes. Bonus. I hope it's not nasty. It's not. Okay. Something good? Bubble gum. You're correct. Oh! Whoa. That's so, cute. So I had two at the end. I was trying to figure which one was harder, and I gave you that one. Okay. But, but you would have gotten it either way. I would have gotten it either way. Yes. All right, that was so fun. I, I am not worthy. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> okay, now I'm sure all of you guys also love scratch and sniff stickers. I mean, these are like the smell of our childhood of the 80s but we have a question for you guys so next week we will start season two of our 80s life podcast and we are getting ready to record our next podcast so we want to ask you guys a question and the question is what did the 80s smell like hmm. It smelled like a lot of things. A lot of things. What comes to mind? What smells make you think of the 80s? So this could be cologne, perfume. It could be cosmetics. Products, it could be toys. It could be foods. Food, candy. Yeah. Uh, places. Whatever smell makes you think of the 80s. We want your comments. And we're going to share some of those on the podcast next week. So comment below. Tell us. What did the 80s smell like? And I'll tell you one thing it did not smell like. Teen Spirit. <laughs> that was the 90s. That's the 90s. Don't say Teen Spirit. <laughs> All right. We'll talk to you guys soon. Bye. Bye.